Memorial Day is a time to remember all those who made the ultimate sacrifice, but it's also the holiday many in the Ocean State look forward to as it typically signals the start of beach season. But 2020 has not been your typical year, and this year's beach experience will be a little different. Iowa News reporter Logan Wilbur explains what the start of beach season looks like throughout the Ocean State and how beachgoers feel about new restrictions. Governor Raimondo has said countless times she wants to get beaches open and she will do that in less than five days, albeit with restrictions. While two state beaches are going to be open on Memorial Day, towns throughout the Ocean State may be able to accommodate you if you're in desperate need of sun and salt water. Listening to the sound of waves crashing will be limited to start the beach season with only East Matunic and Scarborough State beaches slated to be open on Memorial Day. Beachgoers will see capacity limits on both people and parking, and just like other public places, certain face covering requirements, none of which seems to be popular down in Narragansett. I don't want to be sick, and I don't want anyone else to get sick, but um, some of the restrictions are tough. I don't like them. <laughs> I don't wear a mask. Denise, who has lived at the beach her whole life, says these restrictions will only add to the disappointing year for South County. There's a lot of stuff that's been canceled already, like the seafood fest, blessing of the uh, fleet, all, the, all that brings people in town. With restrictions and limits at state beaches, up in Barrington, it's a different story, as the beach will be open to anyone willing to make the trip, with the town offering day passes to non-residents. Michelle says the town has taken precautions to make every beach trip as safe as possible. We had the beach house a couple weeks ago. We had it sprayed with an antimicrobial spray that's supposed to last six months. We also have an officer that will be on duty full time this weekend to help people and also to assist where needed. And I've hired an extra staff person who's solely dedicated to cleaning and sanitizing all of the areas that the public tend to touch a lot. Michelle says face coverings will be needed in heavily populated areas, but lifeguards will be on duty in Barrington, ready for anyone looking to enjoy an early season swim. We've gone to great extremes to try to make people feel safe while still having fun at the beach. Here in Barrington, the beach will be open for Memorial Day weekend, but not every town across the state is ready to dive into summer just yet. We will have a full list available on our website, WPRI.com, of all openings as well as restrictions for beachgoers. Reporting in Barrington, Logan Wilbur, Eyewitness News.